Let's talk about pronouns. Um, with Joe Carstairs, we are talking about a real person who existed in the 1900s um, and lived through from 1900 onwards. Um, and they're not around today. Joe can't tell us how they identify, what pronouns they want to use, how they think about themselves in terms of their gender identity and their sexuality. And all of those things are so personal and depend person to person on how you feel most comfortable being referred to. Um, and because Joe isn't here to tell us that, we just don't know. So we use what we do know about them to kind of inform the language that we can use. Um, we know that Joe rejected femininity, um, the standards of femininity from their time and the society they lived in. They hated being called Miss, they re rejected their birth name and changed their name to something that felt closer to them. So in that sense, feels like a transmasculine or a non-binary leaning uh, identity. Uh, they landed quite hard in masculinity, they presented in male clothing from the time. Um, so in that sense we use they and he interchangeably. They in a non-binary kind of way, is that how they would identify? Maybe. It recognises the ambiguity, the sense that we don't know, so it's a one to use until you can be told. Um, and he, him sometimes, because maybe they would be trans mask, maybe they were non-binary. We don't know. But still, um, she, her, was used by some of their closest friends, their lovers. They did refer to themselves as she, her sometimes uh, in their, later on in their life. Um, and they were quite comfortable playing in the fluidity of sometimes dressing feminine, sometimes dressing masculine. Um, and the, um, the unclear answer is we simply don't know. Um, gender does not equal pronouns, pronouns does not equal gender. Um, so the best thing that we can do to acknowledge Jo in all of their queerness and all of their ambiguity and fluidity is to use all of the pronouns interchangeably and equally. Um, changing the weighting from just she, her, probably, they, he, whatever feels right. Um, and we can't ask Joe, so that's all we can do.